Hey guys, so today we're going to be talking about 3D sketching, uh, specifically on how to create this rack inside of Autodesk Inventor. First things first, let's go ahead and create a new part. Notice that you will have to start with a 3D sketch in this case. right? So starting off with the line, looks a little bit different. It's asking us what kind of a plane or which plane do we want to start off on. In my case, I'm going to start on the XY plane. Starting off on the origin then, drawing my line, notice that I'm going to give it a length as well as a angle, right? So I'm going to do this for the rest of the outside profile. Now my end goal here is to create the outside profile and then do a sweep of a circle, right? So I'm going to need a 3D sketch as well as a 2D sketch in this modeling environment. So giving it a two and a half inch length, notice the angle is also associated there. Once you stop the 3D sketch, you can still continue on the other side that you started off with, right? So again, selecting the plane, giving it a length and an angle. Now the way that I'm switching back and forth between the length and the angle is by hitting the tab key on my keyboard. So now that I've created the profile, I will want to add some fillets to the 3D sketch. Notice in this environment though, it's called a bend. It's essentially going to give you the same result. So there's my 3D profile. Now I want to create a plane on which I can create a circle to sweep that profile. Creating a plane normal to a sketch and a point. I'm going to create a plane on that end point there creating my circle of eighth inch diameter, sweeping the profile, and then finally mirroring that body, right? So that's been 3D sketching, guys. Hope it helps.